So in terms of my main takeaways from this report, uh, the first is that for decades, the Egyptian military have been allowed to engage in economic activities as a way of reducing the official defense budget, i.e. shifting some of the costs to other areas where they wouldn't appear in the defense budget, but also of compensating senior officers in particular for relatively low pay and pensions by giving them the opportunity to acquire extra incomes and fringe benefits. Uh, but the overall volume of this economic activity was relatively modest until 2011 when President Hosni Mubarak was forced out of power. Since 2013, when the military took power and Abdel Fattah Sisi became president, um, the military economy has been transformed. This is because Sisi has relied on the military to take over major management roles in the civilian economy, effectively replacing the government in awarding contracts and undertaking management of the crash program of civilian housing and public infrastructure that the government has been funding for the past four or five years. And so the CC relies on the military to manage about a quarter of this volume. Uh, it also is helping to provide civilian markets with affordable goods, including food commodities and other important goods, and also to increase revenue for the straight tr state treasury. One of the dangers of this is that by relying on the military to compensate for the failings of civilian agencies to provide management of the economy and of public infrastructure and to help markets, um, what's happening is to further marginalize and weaken these same civilian state agencies and that means racking up problems for the future. The additional problem is that this approach overlooks and papers over the real structural problems of the Egyptian economy, which have to do with low productivity, low investment in all sectors except for energy and real estate, which is where most of the boom happens, um, and low local content, which means low value added, especially in technology dependent sectors.